Hi, my name is Liz Vestal. Uh, I'm representing the United Way of Greater Williamsburg. I'm the initiatives manager at the United Way of Williamsburg. So my main uh, responsibilities are community outreach, volunteer engagement, and uh, program coordination. Uh, the mission of the United Way is to improve lives by mobilizing the caring power of community. Uh, we found that uh, members of our community are incredibly um, active and they want to help and they want to provide help to their neighbors. And the United Way facilitates uh, community engagement. Um, and we provide uh, traditional United Way functions, we fundraise, and then we uh, invest money in programs in our community that can help those most in need. Um, our United Way also provides direct services. So we have a community resource center, which is where um, people can go if they need help with basic needs and, uh, and if they're in need of services. So we see about a thousand people every month at our community resource center and people might go there if they're in need of help with their utility bills, if they need help um, uh, providing food for their family, paying their rent, uh, even looking for a job and managing their finances. We also uh, provide a mobile food pantry every month uh, with food supplied by the Virginia Peninsula Food Bank. And this is where families and individuals can register in advance uh, and visit our resource center and then they can receive fresh produce and meat supplied by the USDA. So in that way we're working with community partners to um, alleviate some of the burdens uh, from food insecurity. And uh, these volunteer attorneys will meet with people who would otherwise be unable to afford uh, legal resources and they can provide advice and often may see a case through to the end. Um, we do quite a number of programs with uh, partners. Uh, we're, we're involved in a housing collaborative, which is where we work with uh, members of local government and other nonprofits to help problem solve um, how we can help alleviate homelessness and um, families that are insecure and unable to uh, really maintain a secure living environment. Uh, it's a huge challenge, but the United Way is committed to working with um, other agencies and members of our local government and members of our community to solve problems that are most pressing to our members. Uh, we also do a furniture share program. Uh, members of our community are very uh, giving of their time and their resources. So we pick up furniture often once a month, mattresses, couches, tables, anything that families might need when they're uh, transitioning you know, from poverty back to um, working. Um, the main event that we do every year is our annual Day of Caring. Uh, and this is one of those fun and exciting events for the United Way. We have over 500 volunteers that come out and they give their uh, time, energy, resources, and they help improve and provide um, services for nonprofits in our community. So for instance, uh, Chesapeake Bank is one of our huge volunteers and last year they worked at Head Start. Uh, they helped volunteer with children in the classroom. Uh, Newtown Dental Arts, which is a local business, worked at the Heritage Humane Society, cleaning cages and uh, kennels for, uh, for um, pets. Uh, Williamsburg Landing volunteers every year at the hospice house and they help with landscaping and painting and just general repair. Anheuser-Busch is also a local company that is hugely supportive of the United Way and they work every year at, the child, at child Development Resources which is a large nonprofit in our community that helps children with developmental disabilities. So Anheuser-Busch uh, donates a significant amount of time and resources every year, uh, improving the facilities at Child Development Resources. Um, the Rotary Club works at Dreamcatchers every year. Dreamcatchers is a therapeutic writing center, um, and the Rotary uh, cleans their barns, installs new equipment, and, and works to really make that facility the best that it can be. Uh, James City County, our local governments, are hugely supportive and they've worked with um, Sisters of the Franciscan Brethren to improve the houses they keep for persons needing um, support. Uh, Sentara is a major supporter also of the United Way and last year they worked at the Girl Scout camp at Camp Skimino and they, uh, they provided services to improve the, um, the the huts for the girls camp in every year and Sentara brought out about 40 people which was great and they're always so excited about Day of Caring. It's a very fun event and uh, we love doing it every year. 
So um, we appreciate everyone that supports the United Way, our, all our local government, our citizens, and our local businesses. <laughs> uh, so with that being said, I appreciate uh, the video show having me on here to talk about the United Way of Greater Williamsburg. My name is Liz Vestal. I'm the initiatives manager. And if you'd like to become more involved with your local United Way, we encourage you to reach out to us. All right, Day of Caring this year is on Friday, September 19th. Uh, last year for 2013 Day of Caring, we had over 500 volunteers participate in over 50 projects in our community. Uh, this year we encourage not only residents of Williamsburg, but residents of the entire peninsula to get involved at the United Way. If you'd like to participate in this year's Day of Caring, we encourage you to visit our website at www.uwgw.org or call our offices at the United Way. We'll work to help you get involved with your community.